Is Turtle Wax's new graphene infused flex wax the real deal? Or just another auto detailing scam? Hello everyone, I'm Gary, and you found the That Detail Guy channel where I aim to share the best tips, tricks, and reviews for auto detailing. So before I get started, I just want to point out the fact that I am not sponsored. I do have an Amazon Affiliates account, so if you guys want to support my channel, you guys can easily just click one of the links below, buy a product, and as always, you guys can click that subscribe button, click that bell, so you guys never miss another update from That Detail Guy. sharing my thoughts on Turtle Wax's graphene infused flex wax. This will be about a five month update using my absolutely filthy personal vehicle. Uh, this demonstration should show how durable this product is and if it can withstand the abuse of the real world or if it's just another one of those products that's designed to perform well in social media tests. Lastly, I plan to show how easy or not this product is to apply and I will attempt to demonstrate the different application methods that Turtle Wax claims can work. Well, Turtle Wax states that this product delivers unreal depth of gloss, slickness, chemical resistance, and water repellency and stain prevention. They also state that this product will cut your next detailing job down to size verbatim from their website. At first, the neglect really wasn't intentional. My family and I recently moved, had a baby, bought a new family car, and life was just a little bit too crazy. Not only could I not park in my garage because of the entire garage being filled with everything that we were moving, but I also didn't really have that much time between washing customers' cars and getting the house ready for the new baby. I just did not have time to tend to my own vehicle. Additionally, I had just put an epoxy coating on my floor. Yes, that video is coming soon, which meant I still couldn't get my car in the garage. All right, so let's talk about the application methods. First, you're gonna to wanna to baseline the vehicle. That means you're gonna to wanna to wash, rinse, clay, and polish if needed. So after you baseline the vehicle, Turtle Wax states that you uh, need to apply the product using two sprays per panel to a clean and dry surface. You're gonna use a folded microfiber towel and you're gonna use another towel that is slightly damp to remove any streaking or high spots. Me personally, I like to use uh, either detail spray or waterless wash. Instead of using a damp towel, I'll just do a couple sprays and wipe it down and usually that, uh, that takes away any streaking. So Turtle Wax claims that you can use two different methods uh, for maintenance after you have that nice base coat applied. And I really think this is where the, the Flex Wax gets its name. Um, so the first method is gonna be to apply it to a wet, an already wet vehicle. Um, like I said, you already applied a base coat, You've, you, know, you just washed your vehicle, you've rinsed all the foam off, and now you're gonna apply this, uh, this product as you're wiping the vehicle dry. And what that's gonna allow you to do, increase the water repellency, that's just gonna kind of activate the product once again. This is the method that I use, and it really is a very quick method um, to apply a wax and have it looking really good. The next one that they talk about is basically starting at the very top of the vehicle, you can like spray a bunch of product on the, on the hood and then use your hose to kind of spread that um, product out all over the vehicle. So it's, you know, I'm, I'm guessing that you would just spray a couple sprays and then spray it and then it's supposed to just kind of coat the vehicle like that. It's way easier just to apply it while you're drying. It's almost a drying agent and uh, you're gonna get some really great results. So 
Hopefully you guys can use one of those two methods if you like the results from this video. As you can see, the um, hydrophobic properties are still pretty much intact even after five months of abuse. You can see just how filthy this vehicle is um, by me rubbing my uh, fingers across the, um, the hood. And you can see just like the amount of dirt. I know it's kind of hard because my vehicle is silver, but I mean, there's a significant film, which is usually indicative of somebody who's neglected their vehicle for several months. And it's pretty evident. For the most part, I would say that the hydrophilic properties were intact where I noticed that it was failing quite a bit. Um, was at the bottom half of the vehicle and then um, on the roof. If I'm being completely honest, I don't know if maybe I just got lazy when I was applying it, you know, five or six months ago, or if the, you know, coating really broke down. But on the hood, um, on any of the panels, the windows looked really good. I still really felt like this product was holding up even after, uh, you know, five months or more of neglect. Um, so that being said, this product is $20 a bottle. I have no issues with where it failed because in a normal setting, I'm gonna wash my car probably at least once a month. And really I was kind of neglecting this vehicle because I needed to out of necessity. And then also just because I knew I wanted to shoot a video demonstrating how well um, this product worked. I hope everybody kind of gets something out of this video. And um, now we'll go ahead and switch back to my other audio and uh, go ahead and wrap things up. Personally, I use this uh, product when a customer brings me a brand new vehicle. Um, I think that for one, it's gonna make my job easier in the future um, just because of the water repellency. And then uh, two, it's gonna make the customer happy because they brought me a new vehicle and I give them a vehicle back that looks even better than they gave it to me. I think this is a great product for people that maybe can't afford a ceramic coating or don't really see the value in spending a few thousand dollars to get their uh, vehicle coated. Um, I think this is a great in-between. Um, I can't give an apples to apples comparison just because I don't actually uh, apply ceramic coatings at this time. But what I can say is this product works well enough to where I haven't really had to put the brain en energy in trying to you know, start doing ceramic coatings professionally. Um, and honestly, I probably never will just because you know, the only reason I see to start doing that is because I know that the ceramic coating guys are making a ton of money and like super awesome, but my target market right now doesn't really lend itself to customers who are gonna spend thousands of dollars on their vehicles, uh, to, you know, just to have them coated. So this is a great product for me um, to give the customers a little extra value um, and it's gonna make my job a little bit quicker. Um, and you know, that's kind of why I use it. Once again, guys, thank you so much for uh, viewing this content. Um, I just want to remind you guys again, if you like this type of video, then please subscribe, crank that uh, notification bell so you don't ever miss any more updates in the future. Um, thank you guys for visiting that detail guy, you know, and have a blessed day.